Hello, good morning. It's Monday the 30th of November and I'm wearing my limited edition new Amy Winehouse 10 year anniversary gold um, Fred Perry top. I love this top. I bought it for myself last week as a present from me to me because I can. Um, yeah, it's Monday today. I've got um, 28 and 6, 34. 40 parcels going out today. I've done some of them already because some of them are for subscribers and friends. Um, so that's six I've done already. And um, and then I'm going to do my Etsy ones because mum just said that she's going into town. I'm like, oh, can you take my post for me? And then that's one job that I don't have to do. So I can go into town tomorrow instead for a mooch. But it means not having to do like two days in a row mum's going in anyway so that's cool and I want to have a bit of a move around in here so see Calax unit I want to move to the top of this I've written all this down in the exact order that it needs to be done on my to-do pad um so do 10 listings as well I've got to do my tonight's listings post buy 10 extra boxes from Tesco put remaining jewelry which is those it looks like four boxes there, there's one at the bottom, but it's actually three and then one's got broken stuff in it. Um, put remaining jewellery in those boxes, stack up the boxes against the wall where I want the shelving units to be. Move that unit upstairs, move the chair that's upstairs down here. Rearrange those bits of furniture um, by the radiator so it'll be nice because then I'll have my nice tartan chair and seating and, the, and my drinks cabinet for Christmas. Um, sort out the things to go upstairs, which is like the things on the bottom shelves behind the sofa, mainly, so that I can, not today, rearrange the shelves, but I will rearrange the shelves because they're getting quite full. Um, make my drinks trolley, so I'll take my, like, the booze out of there and I'll put it on drinks trolley and then sort out stuff to be donated. So that's quite a lot. I don't think I'll get it all done today, but I would like to get the stacking up of boxes and maybe the moving of the unit upstairs and the chair downstairs. So I'm gonna write on this to-do pad to do um, this week. Otherwise, I will feel far too much pressure on myself to do it all today and then I'll break my back and I don't want to do that. No, I definitely don't want to do that. Right, and then this is all the stuff I've got to get from the garage of sales made Saturday, Sunday, some Friday, some might be Friday as well. Can't remember. Um, yeah, and there's a lot of breakables, so that's going to be fun. Anyways, I need to do my Etsy post first. I think I've picked out all my Etsy orders anyway, so I might as well show you them now while, while you're here. And before I get all of that stuff. So, some nice Etsy orders today. We have got um, some gold dolphin earrings, gold star type. They, they're round and they got stars on them. Gold glass drop earrings and gold Shambhala beads earrings. Um, where's the, oh my god, this brooch. I'm actually jealous of the person that's brought this brooch because it is so lush. Like, proper Art Nouveau. Like, sterling silver with a Christophase, Christophase. I think possibly green stone and real pearl dangle there. It's just lovely. Just lovely. Anyway, so that's going to make a nice present for someone, I think. This little gold um, crystal, like a spinner. The crystal spins round. That's quite cute. A sterling silver and smoky quartz, like nice long drop necklace. Um, what's the next one? Oh, poison ring. Just going to America. Going to Texas. Um, and that's cool. And then, like, that opens up. I mean, it's actually like a picture frame room, but, you know, 
It's also a hidden locket kind of ring, also called a poison ring. Some little sterling silver teardrop earrings. Oh, that's it. That's it for Etsy, which is quite a lot, actually. That's a good weekend sales, them. So I'm really chuffed with that. So I've got a package of these up, uh, ready for me, ma'am, to take into town to the post office. And then I will gather together and do the rest. Such fun. Freezing outside. I was in the garage and I had to put coat on and stuff. Ooh, it's cold. It's chilly. It's chilly. It's chilly. Right. Stuff going out today then. So we have got... Uh, this is gonna this is gonna be long, it's 29 items, alright? So sorry in advance. So a next jumper for eleven ninety-nine. <sighs> Salt and pepper pots went for 14 pounds. Retro trunky plastic bracelet went for eight pounds. Uh some job lots of costume jewellery rings. This lot went for forty pound plus postage. A spawn figure went for eight pounds. A job lot of watches went for nineteen ninety nine. An Art Deco brooch went for nine ninety nine. A little photo coy scarf ring went for seven pounds nineteen. A little. Sparkly bracelet went for eight pounds. Where's this gone? Tweed perfume. Tweed perfume went for seventeen pounds fifty-nine. A sterling silver bracelet. I think that's you. Went for thirteen pounds fifty. Um, these rather fabulous 80 style earrings went for $8.99. A little Bo Peep style dress went for £27. It's like a bridesmaid dress, all frills and shoes. A white stuffed reversible A line skirt went for £11.99. A little job lot of uh, jewellery boxes went for £11. A hideous baby fat, it's called baby fat with a pH ring, went for $7.99. A pampered chef set of cookie cutters went for $11.99. A long lit big tankard went for £13. An amber glass oil lamp. Went for £23. Bagley Posy Vase went for £13. Another little Cat Heart Necklace went for £14.99. Benefit Makeup Kit, £34.99. A duvet set that I did originally buy for myself for a fiver and then I changed my mind um, went for £12.50. A uh, Topshop pleather skirt, £9.50. Uh, nine carat gold sparkly heart necklace, £31.99. Monet necklace, £19.99. A sterling silver thimble, £17.99. A sterling silver Taxco Mexico modernist bangle, went for £40. And a little blue and green glass sterling silver ring went for £6.75. <sighs> Blimey. Right now I've got to package up all these buggers, isn't it? Mm. Post finally done and it's like, what time is it now? It's quarter to one, nearly time for lunch, but just had this delivery. Azumi's quite excited by it. Aren't you, Bucket? Is a nice big box for you, just for you to play with. Nice big box. Beth, I'm gonna open what it up. It? I shall show you in a minute, Mummy. Very exciting. And this is what it is that I've got. It's one of them 
Cool. Massage your chair things. It's not going to stay here. I'm going to move like a uh, chair downstairs and put it on. But it does all these things. Vibration and let's have some heat. And yeah. Mum, do you want to give it a go? What does it do? It does, it does. Oh! <laughs> oh, mummy not tall enough for the neck <laughs> massage bit. No. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Is it good? <laughs> it does, it's got lots of fun. Have a look on the remote. There's lots of functions. So you can, like, oh. as me wants to look. Oh. Up, up, back. Well, she lower back. Oh, oh, yes. <laughs> sure. Is it making you click yet? Oh. <laughs> oh, it's good, isn't it? Yay. Can't wait to actually put it on the proper tear and, and oh, it's going to be nice. Ooh. And Azami has also got... Ooh. A little toy, because she likes a bit of wire that goes around the plug. Lucky you, Asmi. Right, just going to have some lunch before I nip out to Tesco's. It's one o'clock. Just got some cheese, some Atkins crackers, and a couple of slices of corned beef. Beef. Off to Tesco, yay. So, cool thing happened this morning. Uh... A while ago, I changed over to Talk Talk, and it's been alright. Um, I didn't realise there was an offer on for switching over, where I got um, a £60 voucher. So you could choose from like uh, Marks and Spencer's, Tesco, or Amazon. And seeing as I was going to Tesco anyway today to buy stuff, like, oh, that's a nice coincidence. So, I'm going to buy some more storage boxes which will obviously still be a business expense. Um, and maybe a little bit of booze. <laughs> so it's a free booze. That's nice, isn't it? Anyways, we'll have a little look around, see what there is to spend some money on. Hooray. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hooray! Alright, so we've got a little sort of gifty set of things. The following yes, please go to the Mystery gin experience. Not particularly exciting. Jack Daniels, Guinness. I wonder if they got any beery type ones. Hmm, blend your own whiskey. Oh, hang on. There we go, nice one. Right, and I've got 20 pounds left to, um, to spend on other stuff. So I'm thinking a club card price £12 on a bottle of Kahlua or do I go for De Serrano Velvet Liqueur Smooth cream with the unmistakable taste of De Serrano Hmm Or some Cherry Brandy Liqueur £10 Or some Gingerbread Latte some salted caramel or some Baileys. It's got to be something Christmassy anyway. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. <sighs> I do want a coffee. Oh, Shall I? I do like those tights. I know, they're rather funky, aren't they? Mm. They're some snag tights. <laughs> Figgy pudding, they're called. Um, I didn't tell you, did I? No, but, no, I didn't. I didn't tell them. 
I got a £60 voucher from Tesco. You know when we changed our list to Yeah. It was an offer on, apparently. Oh, so, right. Nice surprise. So today they sent me a £60 voucher. So I bought my boxes. I bought a little present for James. No, my friend. So that's for James. And then for us, Oh, what a jolly good idea. Brilliant. Tia Maria and Terry Brandy. Lovely. Yeah. So all for free. It's all right, isn't it? Right, I'm making a start on um, piling up all of these. That's all necklaces, unlisted necklaces. Um, they're more like summery ones and there's some vintage plastic ones and vintage gold and silver tone ones uh yeah um these ones i've got that is all broken and that's about i don't know seven or eight kilos of it i think and then that's all pretty much single earrings i've got a vintage lot that i'm gonna auction and then that's the start of another two kilo bag and then i've got that's a ringed lot that i'll auction some single cufflinks i sold recently a lot of single cufflinks these are single clip-on earrings and those are jewelry boxes and then that's a random random bunch of coins canadian money american some euros in there um, and yeah random random load of cash um if anybody is looking for broken stuff i think Someone messaged me, I might message them back today. If I didn't message you back today and you want some, message me because I might forget in all of this. Um, yeah, broken bits, single earrings, single earrings. Let me know, anyways. I better get on with this stuff. <laughs> This is what have we done? Uh, got a wall of jewellery. Thankfully, the top two rows are the ones that are used the most. Uh, and then the bottom, say three rows, that's all unlisted stuff. So that's cool. I mean, eventually, when I get my shelves in there, like, and then put like uh, hopefully a door on the front, that's if I'm allowed to do it. Um, that would be quite nice and then move down the chair that was on the landing my mum covered that chair and I put the massage chair thingy on top of it next we've got to move those shelves upstairs to where the chair was and then sort out where on earth I'm going to put all of this crap um, and I've got stuff that I need to redistribute and I'm going to put my drinks on the drink trolley 
ready for Christmas. And Hermes guy will probably come tomorrow now. Which is fair enough. Oh my God, I'm knackered. Right, before creation comes destruction. And I've ruined my front room. But I've moved the picture to over there and I think that, that, that bit is nearly finished there. And I've moved my drinks trolley to here. But now we need something to put there. I mean, I could put that picture back, but I like it over there now. So I need maybe another Tretchikoff or something groovy to put there. So that'll be my cocktail drinks thing for Christmas. So that'll be fun. I do want to clear out the drawers at some point, but that's definitely not a job for today. And I don't think the rearranging of the shelves is a job for today. And in fact, I kind of want to ignore all of this, but can't get to the sofa. Um, I've moved, see, there's a unit there that used to be there. And the things on there, I, I need to sort through as well. And then if we have a look, see, this is what I've done upstairs so far. She's a run away. So I've moved, that was next to the shelves behind the door. So that's come up here. And then these are the Calax units that have come up in the, they fit all right there. Doesn't stick out too far or anything. And then gonna put stuff up to there and then leave the top two empty, maybe just like put some plants on them. So that's, you know, so it's still, I mean, it's bright up here anyway, but yeah. Oh my God, I'm knackered though, and I haven't done any listing today yet. Oh well. Oh, so I've at least just got a pile, that's a pile of stuff to sort out. Pile of stuff to sort out, take upstairs, yada yada, etc. But at least I can sit in that chair and I can sit there and I can sort of get the shelves like when things are. It'll still mean pulling chair out to get to lower, you know, things, but that's okay. I can deal with that. But yeah, I should really do some listing. So I've got, I'm just going to list silver stuff because it's coming up to Christmas and, um, I want to sell silver bits, because why not? So I've got some stuff that I showed in the video, the sparkly bits video from the other day, like the amber and pretty little silver necklaces there. Um, I've got this, which is a little silver kangaroo necklace. That's quite cute. And then this one, which is a nice and heavy Lynx of London, like Tinkerbell. A little charm necklace. So yeah, it's the links of London. So that'll have a, a nice enough price on it. But yeah, that's what I'm gonna do today. I think there's 15 items here, mostly necklaces. There's, a, there's one ring, which is that one there. And then the rest necklaces. Oh, yeah, so uh, hopefully that shouldn't take me too long. I don't know whether to start it now or whether to do it after dinner. I might just do some drafts now, oh, I don't know. Or I might just lie down in front of the telly for a bit. That sounds like a good plan. Oh man, totally friggin' starving. Cannot wait for this. Cauliflower rice, kale, mayo, barbecue sauce, and chili chicken wings. And, and there's some spare as well. Because I'm sure I'm gonna polish these off. Oh, beast. <laughs> It looks dodgy, doesn't it? Oh, it's really quite nice though. Um, anyways, I'm pleased with what I've done today, but there's still a bit of a mess left in here. So uh, join me tomorrow for the second part of me destroying my living space, pretending that it's going to be okay. <laughs> no, it will be. It'll be fine. As me come sit on my lap because she's a good girl. Right. Um. Yeah. Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, bye bye now. Bye bye.